What's up guys and welcome back to Umbrella Dad Gaming. Today we are back with more Pokemon Uranium. And I am so excited to be here. We are about to take on this cave. I guess some Pokemon were kidnapped. And uh, there's not really that much to say because I said so much in the last episode. So let's just get into it. So let's see what this guy's saying. Mike used the PST. Oh, okay. How dare you try to take me away? Take this. Dude, I don't know if you noticed, I didn't do anything. We're just working on leveling up Dig Dug while doing this. We're trying to recover these stolen Pokemon. I'd love to get some encounters too, but there's no brass here and I don't really want to fish because I really don't need a water type. I already have Ludicolo and he's pretty boss, not gonna lie. All right, I don't, I need you to start doing some damage Dig Dug because you are, you're doing great as a tank, but you are not giving me any power here. So how's everybody doing today? I am riding high right now. I don't know why, I'm just feeling good. I'm super tired, but I'm feeling good. I'm excited to record, I'm excited to be here, I'm excited to play this game, I love this game. I wish I had more time to play it. I play it for like two, three hours, and then I don't play it for like a week because I don't have time. <sighs> and I'm trying to record other things at the same time because I don't want to have one series four days a week. But I don't want to give you less than four. Ooh. Nah, he's he's a he's bulky. He doesn't need to be fast. But yeah, I don't want to give you less than four videos a week because I don't feel like that's fair either because that's what we've been doing this whole time. So why stop now? All right, let's see, where are we? Oh, we gotta deal with this. What is that? <laughs> Holy cow. Garlicid. I just named something Garland. I can't name you Garland. Garlicid is here, the Pokemon hero. I found them in a horrible human place and liberated them. We'll fight for our freedom. Is this a Pokemon I can catch? What is that? Luna Pup. What is happening? Is this a Pokemon or a... What is it? I don't know what Luna Pup is either. Let's go for a Metal Blob. It seems like it would be a Psychic type. It's a Ground type. Bye, Dig Dug. Oh, you lived. That's cool, man. Proud of you. All right, let's go to Ludicolo, because that was clearly not the Pokemon to be in with. That's a cool looking Pokemon though, I'm, I'm, I like it. Nope, don't do that, I already switched. All right, let's just Giga Drain this butthole. Bye. I can't believe that Bulldoze didn't kill. Minion. That thing is cool, it's definitely a poison type. I need to switch. Let's go to my ground time. Is it a poison flying, though? That's the question. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say yes. Holy cow! Alright, Ember. Cool, that did good damage. I don't think this one kills. But that, now it does. That helps. What? All right, well, I need one of these now, because I like it. So any, like, fighting move restores its HP a little bit. That is so cool. Okay, so this is a fighting dark type, so I think we can handle it with Ludicolo. Ludi Ludicolo. Oh. So is it just the exact same thing as Mareep, except for it's... Dark fighting. All right, Giga Drain's gonna do a lot of damage. Yeah, that's fine. You're gonna be gone next turn, unless you have priority, like Mach Punch, Bullet Punch, Sucker Punch. Oh, you can get the crit on the first one. Thanks a lot, Shakira. That's some experience right there. Why do those Pokemon fight on behalf of humans? Don't they want their freedom? They're your friends? That's impossible! Pokemon and humans cannot- What? 
Pro, they all just left you. What is happening? Okay, anyway, let's get an encounter. That was freaking weird. Alright. Encounters? Anything in here? I'm starting to think there's not anything in here. Hello? I guess I'll reach in my handy dandy bag and see if I can... Where's my key items? Okay. Made it seem like there was gonna be something. Alright, well, I guess there's nothing in this cave. That's kinda dumb. Oh, hey, everybody. We've managed to re recover the missing Pokemon thanks to you. We followed behind you in case you needed backup, but you did great. We saw everything that happened. Did you... Did any of you see the tiny green man in a costume run by just now? That wasn't a man, that was a Pokemon. Our thief was actually a Pokemon called Garlicid. They're incredibly rare. I haven't heard of one being sighted in many years. Its habitat is in a remote spot in the mountains, so it doesn't encounter humans often. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if that one had never encountered people before. Garlic Kid has a strong sense of justice. It must have seen the Pokemon in the lab and thought we were keeping them prisoner. I suppose they attacked because they were just excited. Perhaps Garlic Kid has a point, though. From now on, we'll make sure our Pokemon have more freedom and we'll listen to them more closely. Speaking of, as the field test for the Pokemon Speech Translator, I'd say this was a resounding success. I can see it's becoming a very useful tool in the hands of a Pokemon trainer, so as the thanks... A thanks for all that you have done for us. Why don't you keep that prototype PST? This is bound to give you, to give us some great field data. Just be careful with it, all right? We wouldn't want it to fall into the wrong hands. If you need anything, we'll be back at the lab. Until next time. <sighs> Mike, if this were a test, I'd say you passed the flying colors. You showed great intuition and resourcefulness. I'd say you're well on your way to becoming a fully fledged trainer, mate. Oh yeah, before I forget, I have an item that will help you on your journey. Finally! Oh, I don't want to listen to you anymore. I just want the experience there. Okay. Alright. Where's this thing at? Where is it? There it is. Give the experience share to... I say we give it to Creamsicle so that he can level up a little bit because... He's our weak link right now. Alright, so this is not the way... We're gonna go back and heal before we find any more trainers. Heck yeah, dude. We got the experience here. That's what I've really wanted this whole time. Because I have all these Pokemon and there's like... I don't know, this game's bad about experience. Or maybe I'm just so used to being babied by the new game and having this full-fledged, super high-level team. I don't know, we'll see. It's gonna help, though. We'll at least have some sort of balance now. So I think we go up here and fight these guys, or this guy. Oh, I'm a lumberjack. Alright, bud, you look like a hiker. Oh, this works out great. Meow. Wow, that really doesn't do that much for being four times effective. I mean, I guess a special attack on a physical slash tank. I haven't actually looked at his stat spread, though. Maybe I should do that. Oh, if I start missing now, I'm gonna freak out. Lose my shit. Alright, we're good. Good job. D -d -d rule Dig Dug. Go, Creamsicle, go! Alright. Let's go back to Alpha. This is another ground type. My water won't close. I'm pretty sure I broke my lid somehow. Alright, let's go Mud Slap. And then I think... We just... Go Don't do my thing that I'm doing back to me. There it is. Okay. Why don't you miss? Yeah, take that flame body. You're taking damage either way. 
I got a haircut today too. I don't, I don't know. In the last episode, I talked about my tattoo and my puppy. I got a haircut. I got everything going on, and somehow nothing at the same time. Will that knock it out? Heck yeah. Mo drill, more like less drill. Oh, I meant to switch. This is awkward. Well, hopefully it misses. Damn. That was some crazy damage. And I made it miss. Heck yeah. And I missed. Saw that coming. And I missed again. So with one accuracy drop, I'm going. If you don't hit again, you deserve to faint. So with one accuracy drop, I missed like three times. And they missed once with like four accuracy drops. Cool, 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 cool. All right. So let's go this way. We already fought you. Do we have... All right, we got Dig Dug in the front. Is there gonna... There's a lot of people here. Like, a lot of people. Hopefully they have some grass in front of them. Oh, Flaffy. I think I need to switch, because I want to try out this guy. Go, Garland. There's a lot of poison Pokemon in this generation, from what I'm realizing. Doesn't affect me, Flaffy. Get it. You do this. Slash and magnitude. That's crazy. That should kill. It's a magnitude 8, and I'm four levels higher. Yeah. Take that. Yeah, Creamsicle. Can you evolve? Luna Pup, which is a ground type. Let's go, Shakira. Does Ludicolo have hips? And if it does, did they lie? Do we fake out first just to be safe? I, I don't, it doesn't hurt anything. We might as well. Some good damage. Yeah, basically my whole run of getting caught up when I did was just Ludicolo everything. Switch train into Ludicolo. He was a beast. Or sh sh well, I guess this time it's a he. No, I don't want to have your number. I mean, if we're on the route, we're gonna fight everyone. Oh, that's cool. So I figured out this cool thing with these bug Pokemon. They all can evolve into the same Pokemon, which is super cool. But they all also have their own evolutions, which is also really cool. Like, such an interesting idea to make them like the queen bug or whatever it is. I really like the idea. All of the Pokemon are terrible from what I've seen, but it's a cool idea, and that's all that really matters. Alright, let's see if this does a good amount of damage. Yeah, I'll take that any day. Ooh. See, it says that they're not good, but they do some damage. Heck yeah, get out of here, spawnery. Yeah, creamsicle, keep going. Alombre. I mean, realistically, I have the advantage, so I should just stay in and fight it. Yeah, you suck. Are you? Do you feel good about yourself? You can't do it twice, bro. I'll take my HP back, thank you. And let's do it again. Get the rest of it back. And I'm fully healed. I thought it said Champion Luigi for a second. I was like, dang, this guy's apparently a beast. He's the champion, and he's just hanging out on this random route. An Ultra Ball! Hopefully we get, like, a sick encounter now. Alright, we found the grass. Let's get away from this trainer. Cool. 
Hello? There we go. New encounter, baby. And we finally got a Tancoon. That's cool. Let's metal claw it and see what happens. I don't like that. Ding, ding. All right, I lift. Cool. Now we can Great Ball, because I'm not going to waste an Ultra Ball on this thing. I don't think it's that good. I hope I'm not, like, the loudest drinker in the world and you guys can hear everything. What does this thing look like? Hmm. Tancoon? How about Albert the Tancoon? I don't even look to see if it was a boy before I did that, so that's awkward. Alright, what's over here? Holy shit, this is a big route. I should have used a repel right here. Are you the only thing here? Alright. There's a repel. Let's go this way. It's just another trainer. Alright, you, I want to fight. Alright, so we're gonna immediately switch out to Garland. I like this Pokemon. I don't like having two ground types while also having a rock type, but it is what it is. They're all cool Pokemon though. I can't get rid of my starter. I can't get rid of Dig Dug. He's the one I have the most emotional connection to. And this thing's just freaking awesome. I'm wondering if it evolves. Come on, Greensickle. It's time to evolve. Kostra. That's the bug, I think. But it's also a ground type, so we're gonna have to heal. Oh, it's the poison psychic. Alright, well let's go Mudslap then. And hope that I can... Alright, it's three shot. Hopefully it misses. Of course not. Is that gonna kill me? Yeah. Okay. Come on, Dig Dug. I know Garland's like the right answer, but Dig Dug needs the experience. Oh shit, it's fast. It still does nothing. What the hell is that, dude? Alright, fine, we'll go with the stab. Seriously? You're a real pain in the ass, Dick Doug. It's a range! Alright, we did it. Green Sickle! That's why you got the EXP share! Kinet Monk. See, but now it might be useful. Alright, so where are we at here? There's a trainer here. He looks like a bug catcher. Bugs are cool, hee <laughs> hee. Well, you're not, Jonathan. That's my son's name. Is this an electric bug? Bug resists ground, but electric doesn't. Okay, it's not electric. It is electric. Is Metal Claw about to be? And so it's not electric, it just turns into an electric type. Copy. And this one's water. I might as well stay in. Got him. Wow, that's like no damage. Oh, it went first. That's annoying. I'm sending in some more. Oh, and freaking Alpha's dead. And for some reason, I went to this asshole whenever he's a freaking straight bug type. That was stupid. Alright, 
Hopefully Bubble can kill still. Or maybe I have a revive in my bag somewhere. Bro, you have so many bugs. Just calm down. Yeah, I don't feel like going all the way back to the PC, so I'm hoping that I... Okay, have a revive for Raptorch so that I don't have to keep doing this. Couple fly, couple gone. Yeah, what the heck? You suck, man. That's not the right pouch. I do have two revives. Let's see, and then I need super potions. You, and you. Alright. Okay, so we're at the end here. <sighs> ha ha! Do I have a rock type move? Of course I don't. Does it have a fire move is the other question. Yeah, I didn't think that would do. Is Air Cutter the one that can flinch? I hope not. Why doesn't it... I'm pretty sure mine has Incinerate, so this one should too. Why doesn't it use it? Whatever. I don't know what this is. That's a cool looking Pokemon. That's a super cool looking Pokemon. Now I'm gonna have to look it up after the recording because I want to see what it is. Is it just a flying type? It's the evolved form of the, the, uh, the Burby. Ah, oh, it gets so much cooler. Did it just roost? You're a dick. That's so annoying. Please don't do this. Okay. Oh my god. What a pain in the ass. I say we go for the Metal Claw now, because you're probably just a flying type. No, it's Air Slash that can make you flinch, not Air Cutter. My brain decided to turn on. Cool. You were destined to lose, because you're a loser. No, there's still more of a route. No. Alright. Now, we'll use a repel. Because I want to go up top and see what happens. There's an item. Holy crap, there's a bunch of stuff up here. Holy butts! So it all leads west eventually. Okay, this leads back to the beginning. Now I know where I'm at. So I can battle all these trainers. This whole episode will just be clearing out this route, I guess. Come on, slap it, quick. Maybe we'll just try to get to the next town and I'll come back and do all this on my own. Dude, that does nothing. Oh, that's gonna suck. Holy crap. Alright, come on out here, Garland. Okay. Boom. Yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take us to the next town. I'm gonna grind up against these trainers off camera so that you guys don't have to watch it. And we'll see what happens. And who knows, I may not even do it right away. I may do it later down the road, but... You guys are here for the story, for the meat and potatoes, for the sausage and peppers, not for the bun. Damn, 
What is this guy? An electric trainer? Juno? That's not gonna knock it out, dude. What are you doing? Yeah, that's not even close. And we can't even go for, like, Slash, because we'll die. Like, we'll get paralyzed. I shouldn't say we'll die. We won't even come close to dying. Got him. Alright. We gotta fight this person, because I want this item. Or maybe we clear out all this and go to the bridge, and then sit on the bridge for the next episode. I think that's a good idea. I'm sure this is the quality content you guys have been wanting. Listening to me talk while I walk through this route and get absolutely nothing done. Cool. So let's see, let's go... Is this thing actually a psychic type or is it like a knockdown sort of thing where it's a normal, normal flying but it just does psychic stuff? I feel like there's so many Pokemon that are like, we're not a psychic type. But we do everything a psychic type does. Like Lucario is the big one. Lucario should be a fighting psychic, not a steel Pokemon at all. Oh, don't do this. That's, that's, that's not any better, dude. Don't do it. Hey, bud. Stop. I'm not enjoying it. Okay. Boom. I'm hurting myself more than it's hurting me. Okay. When are you gonna snap out? Dude. So one miss and two times it hit itself. Super. 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 Is Confusion like an entire... So out of my four turns of Confusion, I've hit myself twice and missed the other two. Super. Okay, you snapped out. Oh my god, and you landed it? Somebody get this guy a cookie, because he's about to get taken off the team. Because I'm over it. Yeah, get out of my face. Heck yeah. All right, what do you have? Aerial Ace? That's so good. Can anybody learn Aerial Ace? Where is this thing? There it is. Aerial Ace to... All right, Tia. Okay, I guess you learned Aerial Ace because you didn't know any moves. All right, let's go this way. And up and up. Don't use another repel. Now let's go over here. I don't want that item that bad. I got what was clearly the good item of the route. How long is this route? Holy butts! Where's the repel? Hey, I got a super repel too. Oh, there's nothing back here? That's pretty cool. Thanks a lot. It's another fight. Holy cow. Okay. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fight this guy, and then we're gonna stop before we hit this cave. Because there's just no point in doing this cave right now. Yours is stronger than mine, and mine is also weakened at the moment. So, come on out here, Ludicolo. And we're gonna fake out next turn because I wanna make sure that it doesn't have sturdy. That's gonna do nothing, yeah. All right, fake out, and then we're gonna get all of our health back. Wow, that might have only done one. Bye, dear old. Oh, it lived! 
that's still not gonna do much. I might as well bubble. Save my Giga Drains. Boom. Alright, let's talk to this. Oh, you're a battle? You just didn't even look at me. What a sack of butts. Alright, sorry dude, we're not doing this. Come on, Shakira. I wonder what the next gym leader's type is. I wonder if they told me what the next gym leader's type is and I was just too stupid to realize it. I still think that I win this fight. I, like, outspeed, I mean. Still crazy to me how little that does. Alright, we got the Giga Drain off, and we don't kill. Oh, we did kill. Sometimes the health bar doesn't look like it goes down. Calmite. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a ground type. Or a rock type. One of the two. Who cares? It's dead. Alright, so, what we're gonna do... So we're gonna end the episode here. And we will start the next episode going into this cave. I'll probably clear out all these trainers on my own time. Um, but yeah, we'll start the next uh, episode with an encounter in the cave. Um, Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Trying to hit 50 subscribers by September. I believe now we're sitting at about 39. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy.